So, folks, I'm here with Howie Hawkins, and Howie Hawkins is the front runner for the nomination of the Green Party for presidency of the United States. Now, you are the father of the Green New Deal, right? I mean, that was your your talking point when you ran for governor of New York, uh, you and other Green Party candidates. But how is your vision of the Green New Deal different from what a lot of the Democrats are putting forward now? Yeah, I was the first candidate in this country to label the program I was putting forward the Green New Deal in 2010 when I ran for governor in New York. But I picked it up from the uh, Green Party of uh, of uh, England and Wales, and then it was picked up by the European Greens. That was 2008, 2009. But it's something I've been talking about since we were involved in the anti-nuclear movement in the 70s. And we had a platform plank in one of the Green Party's uh, platforms calling for, they didn't want to call it New Deal, so we called it the Global Green Deal. So these ideas have been around that we need to transform our economy to clean energy, to deal with the climate crisis. And we need to have an economic bill of rights as part of that Green New Deal so that we can end poverty and economic despair. And one of the big issues, I think, is that with growing inequality over the last 45 years in this country, working class life expectancies are declining. It's unheard of in modern societies, except for Russia, when they you know, transformed from the Soviet Union to the to Russian Federation and had some real economic problems. Well, we got them here now. And so that's what the Economic Bill of Rights is for. So the problem with the Democratic uh, Green New Deal is that they took the brand, which had been the signature issue of the Green Party. I mean, Jill Stein, our presidential candidate, her theme, both of her campaigns, 2012 and 2016, was a Green New Deal for America. That was our signature issue. They took the brand and diluted the content. So by the time this non-binding resolution was introduced by Alexandria Ocasio-Cortez and Ed Markey into Congress, they dropped important parts of it, like the ban on fracking and new fossil fuel infrastructure, like deep cuts in military spending to help fund the Green New Deal. And they extended the deadline to zero to negative greenhouse gas emissions and 100% clean energy from 2030 to 2050. So one of the reasons we're running is to get back to the full strength Green New Deal the Green Party's been championing the last decade. 